thing about those questions is that no matter who you ask, we all have an emotional reaction to those questions. Do you not? Everybody knows what you would or would not do. You might react differently, but we all react out of some kind of habit. Our guest today calls that reaction our emotional style, which is a word now that's going to be integrated in our society. People say, oh, that's her emotional style. <laughs> it's how you behave emotionally. It's fascinating information to know about yourself. And it was the subject of an article in O Magazine. And uh, we came across this book that Tara Bennett Coleman had written. She's a psychotherapist and author of this book called Emotional Alchemy. She identified 10 emotional styles that nearly all of us fit into one or more of them. And she says that we formed our emotional habits early in childhood to help us cope with our environment. And everybody has one or many. But now that we're adults, she says it's important to identify, meaning become mindful, because the whole idea as you become an adult, mature, is to become mindful about your life because your style might be hurting your marriage, yes, or your relationships, yes, or holding you back in your job, and ultimately keeping you from living your best life. So 